Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're sitting in my car on my way to work. Well, I'm at work, but I couldn't find street parking. It sucks, honestly. I was pissed because I actually wanted a street parking because it would have been a lot cheaper for me to do paying by the plate than sitting here, you know, in this lot in the city. Anyway. We are here. I did my makeup really beautifully today. I look so good. I am actually obsessed with me. I am my own. Um, I think I am the most beautiful person I know. Anyway, I have an arranged. I have an array of business card in my card of people that like I, businesses businesses I support, and maybe I will give you a couple of um, things, I'm not sure, but I have a bunch of business cards. The first one is my mom's business cards um, that she has. So I have like her business cards, which is nice here. I also have my friend's business card. She's a para paralegal. So I have a bunch of her business cards. And then I have also another friend of mine that does facials business cards. So I am here supporting everyone's businesses and giving business cards left and right to people that I know. And I love to do that for people. Like I absolutely love giving people my friends' business cards and you know, and just, you know, whatever. Okay, anyway. So I wanted to talk to you guys a little bit about I don't know and I feel like I'm in a rut right now and I know that I always say that but it's the truth like I'm always in a rut and I know how to get out of this rut but I don't know how to like get out of the rut if that makes sense so I start school in a couple of days and I'm actually very excited about starting school I'm not nervous at all I'm actually looking very I'm looking forward to go to school and I think that I'm going to be I'm go it's going to be like a really good experience for me to go in person to go in person because I think that I deserve to be a fabulous bitch out here and um, I cannot wait to take you guys with me and experience this with me. I'm going to block everything. I'm going to block my first day of school, bitch. I'm going to block my outfit of the day. I'm going to block everything. And the one thing that I really, 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 really want to do is start working out consistently every single day. And one of the things that I want to do, well, because I'm going to be going to school Monday to Fridays from like 10 a.m. to like 8 p.m. I'm going to be in the school every single fucking day, bitch. I'm going to be basically a slave to the indoctrination of the system. I'm not going to be indoctrinated. You guys know how I am. I'm very um, free thinker. I think for myself, I am a very... Although I go to like a very liberal, liberal school, I don't think that has nothing to do with um, my thoughts and opinions. It's really hard for me. I'm not a follower. When, I'm not a follower when, when it comes to like thoughts and opinions. I don't know how to exp okay so you know how some people they have opinions and their opinions are influenced by their education well my opinions are not influenced by my, by my education because honestly the way that I think it's because I question everything okay I question absolutely everything and I question I question my life okay I question everything and because I'm a very curious person I've always been a very curious person and I'm and I've always been recept I'm a, I've always been receptive to new information and info and I'm and I always question things it's not like oh it is what it is because it is what it is it's not it's not it is what it is because the sky is blue well what bitch why this why is the sky blue you know what I mean so I could question everything so um Anyway, but I'm just looking forward because I feel, I don't think, I don't think being in school right now, it's an achievement, obviously, because I've invested so much money already. 
uh, you guys know that I since a young age since forever ago I basically have been working for myself I have been um, not only working for myself but I've been supporting myself financially emotionally everything I am in therapy but like honestly I'm I'm uh, I don't know how to explain I'm in therapy right now because I actually like my therapist that I have right now I recently changed and you know it is it is just for me to talk because I feel like that I'm bur burnt um I'm a burden to people to talk about things so I like I like a therapist so I can talk about my inner things so I can be selfish for once because to be honest yes I have my boyfriend and I talk about everything with my boyfriend my boyfriend absolutely knows everything that is going on with me but in my opinion in my relationship I don't want to be I don't want my boyfriend to be my emotional punching bag you know what I mean I don't want to put that on him especially when we want to like he knows where I am emotionally mentally everything like that but there are certain things that I don't want to talk to him about because I feel like First and foremost, he might not want to hear it, you know? And I don't think it's fair for me to put all of my dump on him. So, yes, he's there for me. He supports me emotionally. You know, he's a very good support to me. But at the same time, there are certain, th like, the nip, the, the, nitty, the nitty gritties of things, if that's what you call it. I don't want to, like, discuss with him. For example, what's going on with my cousin that um, got pregnant? recently he doesn't want the, he doesn't want to discuss any of that with me so i have opinions that i want to discuss and i'm not going to talk to him about it because i have to, i have to give him the respect of him and i wanted to hear it you know what i mean so like it's it's, it's things like that but other than that whatever second thing is that okay anyway back to the school thing so i'm so excited I don't know um, like I don't know what's happening I don't know what's go what is going to be what is going to be going on I know some of the classes that I'm, ta I'm going to take I'm just a little shy oh okay okay so anyway back to the working out thing so I wanted to start working out again no no, no okay not working out again oh my god they're leaving Fuck. A, a, a parking spot just got available and I would have paid a lot less but I already paid here so there's no point for me to, you know, whatever. I'm pissed. That would have been perfect. But whatever. Anyway, so I'm excited to show you guys what I do. And since I haven't been in person forever, like, I want... Obviously, this vlog is, like, my diary. I talk about everything and everything with you. And it's my diary, my life. So I can show whatever I want. And I would love to go look back at this moment and say, wow. I actually finished my degree going to school like then um the traditional way anyway um other than that i do want to get a, i want to get into a routine that's the point of this video is that i wanted to like share what i've been feeling because i do want to get into a routine i want to i want to wake up super early and um, obviously have my meals especially on Wednesdays Wednesdays is gonna be my longest day bitch I am not looking forward to Wednesdays but whatever I have to do what you gotta you gotta do what you gotta do right um I only I have I think five classes one of them is online and the other one is in person I thought that I was gonna finish my entire major online to be honest I never knew I never thought that I was gonna go back in person and like honestly i was i've been very lucky for the cat for the past two years three four years that every class that i need i can do it online and i'm pissed a little bit because it's like why is my class not online right now wow but whatever i'm drinking a little matcha from duncan to be honest this is my last time buying matcha ever made already because it's very sweet i feel like i'm drinking diabetes right now matcha is not supposed to be this sweet honestly it's supposed to be bitter we like a bitter matcha that's that's how matcha is supposed to be that's how matcha is supposed to be 
It's supposed to be. It's supposed to is. What am I saying? On Sunday, I'm gonna get my hair done. You guys wanna see fabulous me again, bitch. After this, I'm gonna start getting my hair done more often and doing my own thing using the actually using the fucking Dyson that my boyfriend got me that I literally begged for a whole year. I begged for this freaking um thing for a whole year and I probably only used it a handful of times. That is disgusting of me. Like why did I beg for this when I don't even use it? You see what I, this is what I'm talking about that we think that we know what we want but we really don't know what we want. I'm so grateful that my boyfriend gave it to me like gave it like gifted to me and I have it but I barely use it. So you don't fucking need a Dyson. You think you want it but you won't need it. You won't use it. You will not use it. If you have my hair texture, you will not use the Dyson, bitch. And that's and you're going to see that when you you spend you 500, 600 dollars, you're not going to be able to use it because you will know you will not use it. To be honest, I haven't used it because I have not been doing my hair. You guys know that I, my hair got fucked in the oh, in the hole since my hair got fucked in the hole i have been only well i actually hold on let me let me retract because honestly that's it's the main reason why i have not used my dyson it is because my hair got fucked and i couldn't use a lot of heat but now my hair is back to it's not as healthy as i once had it but it's healthier and that is saying to my best friend kelly like i fucking love kelly kelly honestly like she gave me the best advice she Honestly, like my hair, it is, my hair is so healthy because of Kelly. Like, on, I want to like take credit for this, but honestly, it's because of Kelly. Anyway, so that's that. Then, wait, what was I saying? Oh yeah, yeah. So hair time. So I'm gonna do hair my hair more often, you know. And but on Sunday, I'm gonna get my hair done. My cousin's gonna do it for me. She's gonna like strain it, and then I'm only gonna like she's gonna strain it. But now, like with the hair strainer, we're like with the, she's gonna blow dry it. And then I'm gonna like give it give it volume with my Dyson. Then that you don't need, okay? You won't need Dyson. Then, um, then after that, okay. So on in a couple of days, today's was well, today's Wednesday. Tomorrow's Thursday. On Friday, I have a nail appointment. One of okay. So my boyfriend friend, she's like one of his best friends from high school she was actually one of my best friends in middle school and it's so funny because her cousin is actually my cousin because my uncle and her cousin um had a baby and the cousin and then my cousin is literally her cousin as well it's so it's like funny we're like interconnected it's so weird but um she does nails she does amazing nails and you guys know that i never get my nails done and if I do, I go to this nail tech that I used to go to, but I don't go to her anymore. I feel like she didn't appreciate my coins. And I haven't gone to her for like over a year because then I decided to start doing my own nails because I don't want to spend money on nails. But then I realized that a lot of these places, I mean, a lot of the stuff that I've bought on Amazon, uh, when I used to use Amazon, they honestly are not good quality gels and stuff and lamp and stuff so i decided not to leave my nails alone and not do anything with my nails but i actually i have been wanting i've been like basically craving to have beautiful nails for the past couple of um months and she does amazing job i mean amazing job and i follow her on instagram and i'm gonna let her uh, do her magic on my crusty nails and then after i do her i don't know if i'm gonna go back to her because I want to, I want to, um, then because after I've those nails come off in my mind, what I'm planning to do with my nails is get brush and manicure and color, and that's it, no extensions. This time around, I am gonna, gonna get, I am gonna get extensions, but, um, but after this time, I don't think I want to get extensions anymore because I realized that when I do, I love a long nail. Like you guys know that I am a hot, like I'm a cheetah girl to the heart. Like I'm a long nail girl to like, I love long nails. But unfortunately, long nails um, does not go with my lifestyle right now. I do, when I do makeup and when I, you know, I, I and when I'm serving at the restaurant, like it's a lot and it doesn't go with my lifestyle right now. So long nail is a no for me. 
um but right now i am gonna get long nails i don't know if i'm gonna get like super long nails i'm gonna get medium nails um because i do want like a specific design i never get the sign you guys know that but i've been um obsessed with like the i've been loving for a while and i always wanted to do like the korean um nails stuff and i'm a little upset because now everybody does does the chrome and now people are gonna think well it doesn't matter what people think but i'm gonna get chrome i don't know what type of chrome i'm gonna get but i, I wanted to get like a very natural looking chrome i always love chrome nails because i've always i always follow korean um nail girls on instagram but now because miss kylie jenner decided to do chromes now all of you basic bitch want to do chrome but whatever it's not a big deal that's what happened when I don't get because I don't get my nails often, and the one time that I do want to get my nails now, everybody else have what I want, but that's okay, whatever. I don't care. I don't care to have the same thing as you because I'm not like you. I am unique in my own way, and obviously it's gonna look so much. It's gonna look good on me regardless, but that's what I'm. Whatever, whatever, whatever. I'm gonna do that. Then, um, also on Sunday, uh, I might Sunday. Um, I'm gonna go to my parents' house. I think we're gonna have a barbecue. I'm not sure. And also, I want my boyfriend to be to meet my family from Poland. So we're gonna go to my parents' house. Then DJ is on Monday. On Monday, I have to wake up, um, do my little workout that I'm going to do, do my little morning routine. So my morning routine, I don't know what it's gonna, is, I don't know what it's going to be consistent of, but I want my morning routine to be like every day the same thing. Like I want to wake up, um, be fabulous. Cause you guys know I'm fabulous. I'll be fabulous. And after I finish being fabulous, I want to um oh after I finish being fabulous, I can just drive to school. This semester I didn't pay for parking because when I went to figure out well well whatever was happening with my ID, um the guy that I talked to told me that I really didn't need it. I can just park on campus and it's free. And I said, oh, then that's perfect. Then I don't need to pay for fucking parking. Fuck this parking. So we're not paying for parking, bitch. We're, are, you know, whatever. I hope I don't see people that I know. I have a lot of people that I've dated in the past that goes to my school. And I don't want to see any of them. So... <laughs> Um, and that's why like I didn't care much because I was never in person but now that I'm gonna be in person I, I don't want to see them ever so that's that I think I'm done with this video today I know that I'm just giving you a lot of tea but maybe I don't know like I just give you promises I'm not gonna tell you what, what tomorrow's video is gonna be about because I don't know honestly bitch like I don't know what's happening I don't know what's going on I don't know what I'm oh for dinner tonight I'm eating salmon maybe I'll show you that Maybe I'll show you um, how I cook my salmon by incorporating some of my herbs that I'm growing myself at my home. Also, tonight, when I get home, I am going to um, plant some some peas. I found out that I, I have 70 days until my first frost. So, and I know that peas grows in a cooler, cooler environment. So I'm going to grow, I'm going to plant my snap peas again. And I'm going to throw, and I'm going to basically throw away the one that I have right now. Because honestly, it's like not growing. I don't know what's happening with that. I don't know what's going on. But that's what I'm doing. Maybe today or tomorrow. I'm not sure. I'll let you know. Other than that, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Love you. Bye.